So half past nine on Boxing Day morning, secretary rings me and he says, look, I think the pitch is okay, but the chairman's rolled in and he says he's not happy and he won't open the gates until you say we're definitely playing. So I says, okay, I'll come over early. So I whiz over M62, drop down to Spotland's ground, park the car, walk down the tunnel, secretary joins me, get to the side of the pitch, look to the left-hand penalty area, huge pools of water and some ducks having a bit of a swim. <laughs> not promising. Look to the right-hand penalty area, large sheets of ice, more ducks having a skate. <laughs> Secretary says, what do you think? I says, I think we'll come back in April on a nice spring evening because you can't play on this. We said, look, I'm ever so sorry that we had to put the balloon down 24 hours before we wanted to. Weather's beaten. As he said, I totally agree, Kev, we can't play on this. I'll let the press know we're off and, uh, and we'll see you when we get it rearranged. I said, fine. So I turned to go back up the tunnel, blocking my path is a little fellow about five foot ten, brown smock, flat cap. I said, excuse me. He says, are that referee? I said, yes, who are you? He said, I'm the pie man. I said, you what? He says, I am the Rochdale pie man. He said, did you notice a white transit van in the car park when you came in? I said, yeah, I did. Why? He says, do you know what's in it? I said, I haven't got a clue. He says, in my van in the car park, I've got five and a half thousand potato, meat and potato pies. <laughs> Rumour has it, you've just called this fucking game off. <laughs> I said, you can't play football on here. He says, do you realise I've got a wife and four kids to support? I says, well, they're not going hungry for a few days. Well, they're fucking five, they? <laughs> and uh, I skirted past him up the tunnel car park and away. So we come back in April to play this game. Lovely <laughs> spring evening. Get back in the dressing room. Just getting ready. Knock on the door. It's him, stood there, brown cap, flat, all the job lot. He says, does they remember me, ref? Oh, I said, how could I ever, ah, come on in. He says, no hard feelings about Boxing Day. I said, no, I had a job to do, one of those things. He said, right, from my point of view, no hard feelings at all, and I bought you something to warm you up before you drive home. And he produced four steaming hot meat and potato pies, put them on the table. He said, yeah, kid, have them with my uh, best wishes. I said, thanks very much indeed. Off he goes, he turned around, he said, they've kept quite well since fucking Boxing Day. <laughs> <laughs>